If you've watched any major Smash Ultimate tournament recently, you've probably gotten very used to seeing Joker finishing in first place. So, now many people in the Smash community are wondering, is Joker the best character in the game? Or even straight up nerf worthy? My name is Kristoff, and in this video we're gonna dive right into Joker. Is he the best character? Is he worthy of nerfs? But before we get started, make sure you check out all the great features on Pro Guides, like InstaPro, which gives you instant access to experienced coaches in the game of your choice. We also have a great course with Zero himself on our platform, so make sure to check that out using the description link below. So, there's been a lot of drama surrounding Joker lately, particularly due to the explosive potential he acquires whenever Arson activates. Piloted by MKLeo, Arson has pulled Joker out of many bad situations helping Leo pull off clutch comebacks from the grips of defeat, and even scoring reverse 3-0 set victories after being literally one hit away from losing the tournament. But how much of this is really because of Joker, and how much of it is really Leo's skill? Well, even though Joker is winning so many tournaments, Leo is the only Joker player getting results even close to first place at all majors. But Leo has firmly established himself as a top three player long before Joker's DLC release, winning major tournaments with many other characters such as Ike and Lucina. At the very least, these facts confirm that MKLeo is a significant factor in the overwhelmingly positive results Joker has claimed. But it's difficult to be conclusive as no other top 5 or even top 10 players currently main the character. So, the argument that Joker is purely carried by Leo loses weight when there are no similarly skilled Jokers to compare him to. Now, taking a look at the character specifically, Joker does have an amazing toolkit with versatile options to deal with many situations. He's fast and mobile, has multiple combos at most percents, many kill confirms, incredible recovery and disadvantage state, projectiles, deadly edge guarding, quick frame data, glasses, and then there's the arson factor, which increases his range, damage output, and knockback significantly. Arson also stays active for quite a while and is charged a bit every time Joker is hit, making it very likely to appear when the player needs to make a comeback. Despite the clear strengths that Joker has, many have raised counter-arguments that players aren't playing the matchup optimally. Aside from edge guards, Joker can struggle to take stocks without Arson. His kill confirms are fairly telegraphed, easily losing to shield. When Joker has Arson, it's wise to play more passively, interacting only when a clear opportunity presents itself. Little strategies like running away to bait and punish Aegean can be very effective. In conclusion, Joker is an undeniably strong character, but without other top player representation, it's impossible to say that he is definitely the best character in the game, especially with so many other strong contenders such as Peach, Pikachu, and Palutena. A nerf to Arson's duration, charge speed, or volatility wouldn't be too unreasonable, but it's by no means necessary, as Joker is clearly beatable even in the hands of MKLeo. What do you guys think? Is Joker the best character in the game? Let us know in the comments below and make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss out on any of our daily uploads. And don't forget to check out ProGuides.com for other Smash videos like this.